Hello everyone, so in this video I'm going to be showing you how to check FPS in Roblox and I have my friend here, but anyways, um, basically all you really need to do is, first of all, you need a keyboard, okay? I mean, if you don't have a keyboard, I'm not very sure how you got here, but you know, um, yeah, so get your keyboard, okay? Mine's really loud, but just get a keyboard, okay? You need, a, you need one for this to work, alright? And uh, I'm just gonna get straight into it. So uh, yeah, let's let's go. So all you gotta do is uh, press shift. You know, shift like if you're doing shift lock. You know, which is uh, if you didn't if you don't know what that is, it's uh, it's really cool. But um, basically, all you gotta do is just do shift and F5 at the same time. Okay, so you can't do you can't do shift and then F5. That won't work, right? You gotta hold shift down and F5 at the same time. And then you're going to see this, all right? There's going to be four things here, and there's FPS, Physics, Render, and Network Receive. So, um, you know, you should be able to tell what the first one is. FPS is frames per second, and obviously 60 is the best. And if you have, like, 30, that's, like, medium. And uh, if you have one, and that's, that's pretty bad, you should probably get a different computer. <laughs> but, um... Yeah, so usually it's gonna probably be around 20 to 60 FPS for you guys. And then there's also physics, render, network, receive. Those all should be around 60s. So pretty cool stuff. And that's really how you check FPS. I mean, you could use, you know, other things for so that you can see your FPS on all games that you play other than Roblox. But um, if you just play Roblox and that's all you play and you just wanna know Without downloading anything that could be like a virus or anything, all you really gotta do is just press Shift F5. In a Roblox game, this works in every single Roblox game, okay? So, yeah, it's, it's a really cool feature. And I learned about it like a year ago, and I decided to share it with you guys because I think it's a really interesting feature that Roblox added. And by the way, um, if you're lagging and you notice that this number is lower, like in the 30s and 20s, I'd recommend going to uh, the escape, then click settings, and uh, this thing that says graphics quality, yeah, I'd suggest putting it to there, right there, the first little blue thing. Uh, that should eliminate all lag, and it should, it usually will make your Roblox, you know, look a little bit less detailed and less cool, but I mean, it, it's for no lag, right? So it's kind of worth it if you need it, but uh, I do not, so I'm gonna put it back to normal. And uh, yeah, it's really the whole video. Um, I might make a video about how to remove lag, guys. So if you do need that, um, I will link it down below if I make it, all right? And uh, yeah, it's going to be the uh, entire video. Peace out.